Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Most. Today I'm going to show you the differences between Laravel and Django. So stay tuned. First of all, let's start with the similarities. Laravel and Django both are web frameworks, web based frameworks. So they are used for the web to create a website, to create a back end feed, API, things like that. But what about the differences? Well, there are a few differences. First of all, let's start with Laravel. Laravel is PHP based framework, meaning that the uh, programming language that you use in uh, Laravel is PHP, whereas Django is a Python based uh, web framework. So Python is the language that you can use in Django. Let's move on to the second difference, which is the speed. Django is a little bit faster, but since the release of PHP 7, Laravel is also fast. So let's move on to the third difference, which actually has to do with the uh, hosting service. PHP is actually cheaper when it comes to hosting your website, whereas Python is more expensive. So you need to take this into account. Let's move on to the fourth difference, which is the syntax. PHP syntax is a little bit complicated than Python. Python is neat, clean, easy to understand, but PHP is a little bit difficult. But you need to keep in mind that both frameworks are MVC frameworks, meaning that the design pattern is model view controller. And that makes the code clean, even if you, your friends and colleagues just don't follow best practices they will be forced to write clean code because MVC is because MVC is super awesome when it comes to organizing your code. Now let's move on to which one should you choose, which is debatable, but I'm going to give you some tips and tricks to which one should you choose. First of all, you need to keep in mind that the area in which you want a job, you have to find out which one in demand. So in your area, if PHP is in demand, then you have to choose Laravel. Don't just go to Django and then search for jobs in an area that they don't need Django developers. So you need to know exactly which one is in demand in the area you want a job. The second tip is do you already know PHP or do you already know Python? If you already know Python, then of course you need to choose Django. If you know PHP, then you, you just go for Laravel because you don't, you don't need to spend time um, switching from one language to the other. Just keep learning the language that you are already learning and uh, just specialize in it and specialize in its framework. And when it comes to working as a freelancer, it doesn't matter because jobs are always available when it comes to Django or um, Laravel. But by the way, Laravel is more in demand in general in uh, the field of uh, freelancing, in the world of freelancing. So hopefully after you see this video, you will be able to choose which one is suitable for you. I'd like to know your opinions. Leave them in the comment section below. And also, if you want to learn Laravel or Django, I have created a complete course for Laravel and for Django that will take you step by step on how to create a complete website in Laravel and in Django. So that's it for this video. This is Most. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later.